Dangerous summer heat is spreading across the U.S. Today, Boston baked, hitting a record 97 degrees. At least 82 million people are under heat alerts from the Atlantic coast to Midwest Plains. One of the hottest and driest regions in America was hit by a rare monsoon that triggered historic flash flooding in and around California's Death Valley National Park. Rescues are ongoing after a thousand people were trapped inside as mud flows forced the shutdown of every entrance. Hey again, gaggle of doomers. Make sure to stay protected here. That's the uh the other doomers, the ones without a legal residence, like to kick it here, set up base. Just wanted to ramble a few minutes. Some watching some pretty interesting clips today with electrical firearms. I mean like electric powered Gauss guns and things that can fire uh, drill bits, for instance, you know, because Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to another video on ForgottenWeapons.com. I'm Ian McCollum, and in the interest of a healthier planet, we're starting to transition to solar-powered weaponry. <laughs> Ammo might run in short supply after everyone's ransacked the pawn shops and gun stores throughout America. Yeah, and to all the people coming back to my channel saying, you know, this summer is bad, they feel the heat waves, but they're not really gonna be too worried about it. You know, to those people, I would say, uh, just go to a bridge and nosedive right into whatever lays below, be it a highway or a dry river, for instance, like the drought we're in, because that is utterly fucking stupid at this point. The data and evidence suggests we are headed in a catastrophic situation and if you can take into account just the weather and extreme weather events in the past let's say three years you know 2019 to 2022 the difference is profound i'm not sure where this trail leads i've never been through here it's called finger park try to navigate up this mess wasn't Iran, some city in Iran, the hottest, hottest temperature ever recorded? The with the heat index, it felt like 154 degrees. I mean, I just showed um, show the trailer for Finch the other day. We should be safe once we get into the mountains. But things will happen. Like 150 degree heat, UV radiation, and people. And that's likely the the world that we're heading into because you know this is a message for young people too young people all around the world um well you might say i'm young but i'm past 30 so this is a message to like the 20 something year olds uh your time is short my friend if you feel like you need to go protest or something do that but everything you're doing right now is pretty much a waste of time Okay, just gonna be clear with you on that because as you'll notice, we've just had these record breaking heat waves, and they would come every other week, or in some states and cities, every single day. These are gonna be chained together, and pretty soon there will be no relief in sight. A place where our grids cannot keep up. You and I are heading into a hellscape world, so I'm getting my fill of love while I can. Mm-hmm. Not gonna sound too pretentious here, but I recommend everybody, everybody, man, woman, that you seek to form an intimacy bond, intimate bond with another human being. Because I'm afraid there won't be too much of that by the end of this decade. It'll be just focused on survival. I don't know how we can keep up. I don't know how we're going to keep up with rising inflation, a potential another war breaking out with China, the election season, 
you know, we haven't even agreed on the uh, the deficit, the bill coming up in two months. We got to negotiate that in Congress. We, as in the uh, corporate overlords, everything in my in in a in a in a reasonable everything is trending in the wrong direction. We're at a dead end. You're right, socially, culturally. the end of the world okay this was fun and I just s snooped in on this uh, I think the risk for nuclear war I agree with this professor is uh, now is that is a higher than any other period including the Cold War and listen up also you know these things can go off in a in a heartbeat, we have no protection with hypersonic. Okay? Stop stop wasting your time with with things that don't bring you joy. Just stop. Paying bills. That applies to everything. If it's not bringing you joy, stop it. Now is not the time to be messing around. Nice catching up with you folks. Hello from Arkansas, Northwest Arkansas, Fingers Park. I'll talk to you guys next week. See ya.